Hello everybody, it's Sniff. Today I'm playing a visual novel I've been wanting to uh, get around to for a little while, feeling the weight of it all. This is by Smug.jpg or Smug.jpg Games on Twitter, with art by Woomi or at Epic Woomi on Twitter. Links to both your pages will be in the description, as well as a link to where you can download this game on itch.io and play it for yourself if you're interested. This is still an alpha, so I don't think there's like a full like 50 hour visual novel worth of content here. Um, but I am super hyped to um, check out what the creator has in store so far because boy the girls in this game are all looking so cute. Oh my gosh, look at them. Let's get into it. What's your preferred pronouns? 10 out of 10 game already. I'm gonna be boring and go he him. What's your name? Sn uh, uh, Chad uh, uh, Tom Seeker. Great name, there you go. That's what I wish my name was. Man, four years really flew by, huh? Can't believe how long it's really been. Where did the time go? Well, I finally made it to real adulthood. I can finally feel like a real man now. I wonder what that is if you pick like they, them. I can finally feel like a real person, a real adult. Huh, well, I guess it's time to face it. I'm not a kid anymore, and it's time to make it in the real world. But first, I need to see who is picking me up. Yeah, yeah, I, th I think we're talking about just finishing college or something like that, right? Unless we're just out of high school. Hmm. Hmm. Huh? Dad should be here by now. I mean, I called him over an hour ago, and he was literally here a week ago for my graduation. It's not like he's lost. I mean, he wasn't the best with directions. I don't know why it's taking him this long. Well, whatever. I'll sit here and wait, whatever. Thinking back on it, it's been so much for me. I came in scared and had no friends I, because I came from the other town over, so none of my friends came here from high school. Jeez, I'm moving into the dorms and meeting all these strangers who have been here for probably a year or two, but then realizing that they were just the same as me, scared and afraid of who they would have got it paired with. Our fears disappeared and we all became great friends. But sadly, I'm gonna leave them behind. I hope we stay in touch with each other. I had some of the best memories here. Jeez, I'ma miss this place. Though I did have some bad ones. There was this girl I had in my calculus class last semester. Man, she was such a bottom. She was so prissy and had this godlike complex to her. No, that's probably the girl I was trying to date in the alternate. Like, look, man, I always end up trying to date these girls because they're always the fat ones, man. Haley and the girl for Alice from there. It's always the pussy godlike complex girls that I have to date in these. What a brat. Jeez, man, <laughs> calm down. <laughs> what was their name again? Olivia or something like that. Like I'd ever see her again. Ha! <laughs> But there were some really good times. Like that one girl who in my I had in my first year world history course who was really cute. I was way too shy to even say a word to her, but she was stunning. But what really made up for it was her ability to eat. She would put down food like there was no tomorrow. <gasps> a game where nice girls are fat too? Impossible always snacking on something. She had chips or a breakfast sandwich with her every morning, and she was oblivious to what it was doing to her waistline. <laughs> she started the semester so small and thin, but towards the end of the semester, she ballooned. Now I'm just sad we couldn't get to see any of this. Jeez, I heard of the freshman 15, but this was more like the senior 50. My god, I never really felt like this before. I mean, watching her eat. Putting so much food into that tiny frame to watch it slowly, day by day, growing and stretching beyond what her stomach could handle was breathtaking. Figuratively for me, but literally for her. We've skipped over the best bits, what the heck man? What? You're telling us this now? I want to see this. But my god, when I saw her for graduation last week, she tripled in size. That gown she was wearing must have been a 4XL or more. It could barely contain her blubber. And when she went on stage to accept her degree, watching her jiggle and huff from every slight minuscule movement, it was way too much of a rush. Okay, okay, snap out of it. No Henri on main. Jeez, Chad Tumseeker, calm the frick down. Oh, just in time. I see Dad's car. 
This is our bedroom. I love it. What the heck is this poster over here? <laughs> you really want anyone to walk into your room and be like, Oh, you're one of those people. Besides that, this is a actually amazing room setup. I love the co The colors are so pretty. This is such a bright, happy room. I would, I would, this is such a, such a happy looking room, bro. You have a, what is there? A cactus down there? Uh, Pockle posters? There's not even like rubbish lying around. Weird. You have a cute little circular pillow of the, the little little cat slime freaking anime figure up more plants this is even better you've got the tissues inconspicuously above your bed not right next to your computer which is not a good look god does it feel good to be home to sleep in my own bed that one at my dorm was crap all springy and probably not replaced since the uni's opening feels so good to lay on this bed. I could just... <sighs> okay, so far, we've, uh, we've, 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 uh, we're, we're, we've, we've met no thick ladies and we've just gone to sleep. Mission accomplished. John Tomseeker, come down here, you have a guest! Oh, come on, man! I literally just laid down for a three-hour car ride. Dad gets to sleep. Alright, fine! Coming down, mother! I never get a break. <laughs> Jeez, who could it be now? Door opens. <gasps> a woman visiting us? What kind of fantasy world are we living? Oh, this is a dating. Yeah, this is a freaking visual novel. Yeah, okay, all right, that that that, that adds up. Naomi. Yeah. Now, is that any way you cheat your childhood friend? She's so cute. <laughs> so cute i love i am in love with the art style for this game it's amazing it, N naomi i haven't seen you in years when did you move back about a little over a month ago your mom saw me a few days ago in the town square and we talked about you look at you you're all edumacated now haha <laughs> huh, yeah i guess yeah we went uh we went for a uh, art and communication degree i'm a uh, Pretty sure it's gonna lead into a 200k a year job. Man, I haven't seen her in so long. She looks a bit different. Did she cut her hair? No, that can't be it. No, she put on a bit of weight. Oh god, she looks so beautiful. Play it cool. Wait, she put on a bit of weight? Bro, do you see the string of waist, man? We, we're like her thighs or something? Like her legs are a little fat? Like where do you see the weight, man? So, so uh, how'd Japan treat you? You must have a lot of stories, huh? She went to Japan, I'm jealous. Oh yeah, more than I could imagine, huh? Wanna go for a walk or something? It's been way too long and I'd love to catch up. Yeah, sure. Hey mom, I'm going out. I'll be back later tonight. Dude, you're like gone through university and you still have to like get your mom's permission to go out. Yeah, what? It's like, hey mom, I'm going out to party with some friends if that's okay. Like, dude, can't believe I named this guy Chad. Have fun. Don't do anything you would regret. What's that supposed to mean? I'm, I'm going for a walk. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry, we won't. You still remember the park we used to hang out after high school? Of course, how could I forget it? I miss that place, I haven't been there in what feels like forever. Yeah, let's go! Man, this place never changes, huh? It's been almost two years since I went off after school. Yeah, more like four plus for me. So how was Japan? I bet you had a lot of great food, huh? My god, yes! The food was amazing! I actually gained like 10 pounds, <laughs> oops, but I couldn't help myself, ha <laughs> 10 pounds, it's like, what, is 10 pounds in four years since I've seen you? We'll take what we can get at this point. No, what? Ha <laughs> I couldn't tell. I said play it cool, you fool. Oh, shut up, <laughs> I actually got a personal trainer to help me lose some weight, so I'll be back to my old size soon. Please don't. Oh wow, that, that's awesome. Yeah, back to the old fit and nimble me. Oh, you wanna meet her? I'm supposed to actually head off to Loretta's in a bit to meet her and a few friends. Wanna come? No. Sure, I don't have anything else to do than just roll over in my bed and sleep. Oh, don't be such a downer. Come on, you have fun. When was the last time you were at Loretta's? You used to beg me after school to come with you to get your mocha frappuccino. 
with whatever the hell used to point that huge bowl of sugar that you used to call coffee? <laughs> Jesus, that's what we had? What, what, how big are we? How big is Chad? Did he continue his Starbucks diet? Yeah, yeah, I don't remember that double espresso macchiato with the three times caffeine boost to be any better for you. Whoa, what is she? What is she? Does she work a night shift or something? Yeah, well, at least mine won't slowly kill me like that. Just my heart will explode and be quick and painless, huh? This got real dark. Jeez. A bit morbid. I did not expect that coming for this. She looks so bright and cheery and like sunshine. And then she's like, <laughs> gonna destroy my heart by drinking that caffeine. Fair enough, huh? But still, aren't both aren't great for us. But why meet at Loretta's? It isn't the most Kato way kale, wheatgrass, or kai friendly place to start a diet or working out place at all. True, but it's in the center of town and the closest place for us all to meet. Us? There's others you're expecting at Loretta's? I was hoping we could be alone, milady. Now man chance to meet other ladies and never turn that down. Yeah, there are two more people that's going to join me in the workout class my trainer is doing. I'd like you to meet them too. Come on, let's head there now. We shouldn't keep a man waiting any longer than we have already. Man, Loretta's. I haven't been here in forever. I miss this place. Sure has gotten busier since the last time here. Kind of a, kind of a cool vibe. Not bad, not bad. Just standing here is weird. I wonder where Naomi's workout buddies are. Huh, I feel like someone is watching me. There is! Oh my gosh, we're meeting this girl. Oh my, now this girl, okay, dude, this girl's got a bit of softness, okay. My gosh, she's so cute. Jesus, what a hipster. She, she, she got the glasses, the beanie, the... Look, man, hipster or not, we, we, look, look, I'll t look, it's, it, I would far rather take chubby hipster girl than friggin' chubby princess orders me around, doesn't appreciate what I do, girl, okay? That's what I'm usually stuck with, so this is a huge upgrade. This girl just staring at me off alone in that corner. Does she know me? Does she want something? Weird. Hmm. I don't see them here yet. Maybe we got there a bit earlier than expected. You shouldn't have wanted to leave early. You're the one who wanted to leave the park. Hmm. Pretty sure that was you that said you wanted to leave. I never said that. Ah, uh -huh, sure. Oh, relax. I'm only messing with ya. <laughs> oh, I see them over in the back. Huh, there are three girls over there. I wonder who was the trainer. Yeah, this girl's probably the trainer. Hey, hey, look who it is! My god, she is loud. Loud, sporty girl. Awesome. Naomi, come on over here and sit down with the two girls that will be joining our workouts. Who's the creepo staring at me? And rude, too. Rich looking girl? Oh, no, okay, well... Frick you, lady, you aren't even fat. I don't have to give you the time of day this time. Ha! Could you, like, not embarrass me in front of, like, half of the patrons in this place? Ugh. I can't bring you anywhere. So uncivilized. Why is she so small? This lady's giant. Goodness, this lady in the middle. <laughs> Huge woman. Oh, shut up. You love the attention. Not in this way. Ugh, you are so... Ugh. But maybe you shouldn't be so loud. You're drawing some unwanted attention to yourselves. <laughs> all of the character designs in this are peak. Oh my gosh, they're all so good. I love the colors so much. They're so bright. Zoe, this is Chad Tomseeker. <laughs> Inconspicuous name. Uh, please, guys, it's not what you think. They're an old friend since primary school, and they just moved back from uni. How do you do? I'm Zoe, and I'm fine, I guess. You look like you could join us, too. What is that supposed to mean? Wait, is she saying it's like you could do with some workout training, too, fatty? Don't swear it. I was joshing ya. Did she call me fat or something? Yeah, yeah, don't worry, Chad Tumseeker. Zoe can be a bit rambunctious, but she is harmless. Ha <laughs> ha. Sure, ha <laughs> ha. Uh, hmm. Oh my god, I'm so rude. Chad Tumseeker, this little brat is Olivia. Glad to see we're all on the same page as that. <laughs> oh no, this is Olivia? Oh no! Ah, <laughs> uh, don't be a dog, Naomi. Charmed, I'm sure, Chad Tumseeker. Wait, do I know you from somewhere? Hmm, I can't quite remember. No way, it's her. 
The idiot from my calculus class? No freaking way. I hope she doesn't remember me. God, she was so annoying. Nah, can't remember you. Oh, well. Mustn't have been not worth my time. Thank God. And this cute girl sitting here is Abby. He hello, how are you? She's the complete opposite of Zoe, huh? This is the gang. And with Zoe's help, we're all gonna get back in shape. Back in shape? You look fine. <laughs> what? I, I, what do you, what, I mean, bro, I mean, look, maybe they're aiming for six packs and friggin' Arnold level biceps. I don't know. They're, they're gonna, it's like, bro, until we look like She-Hulk, we're not satisfied. Look, I don't know what their goals are. Ha, huh, that's a joke. I'm like the skinniest one here. Not like cow chest over here. At least my bottom isn't stretching through my dress. What did you say, you cow? This this ladies this ladies look fine. I don't understand. Normies, am I right? Ha! That's what I like to see. Use your anger to stimulate you to get more pump to work at that weight. Use your anger. This is, you're literally having your propel patine train you here. Jesus. Zoe, that isn't helping us right now. And we're making a bit of a scene. These girls are crazy. But Olivia isn't lying about Abby. She does have a massive chest and imagine her with a few extra pounds on her frame. And like, she looks fine. Like, what? And she's a, it's like, Abby, your assets are too large. You need a workout to lose that way. Hey, I'm going to get something to drink. I'll be back. I need to cool down a bit. Being this close proximity to so many ladies is just doing a number on me. Huh. God, I need to leave way too much stimuli at once. <laughs> Calm the frick down there. I really made a mistake calling this guy Chad. Oh my god. Hello, what can I get for you? Marco Frappuccino, please. Plump. Hmm? Huh? This girl is sitting next to me. Who is she? Wait, this is the girl from the corner when we first walked in. Who is she? Hey, I know your little secret. <laughs> huh? What secret? Wait, does she know? That I like. How could she have guessed what it's like? We, we were hanging out with a bunch of skinny ladies. I don't know how she'd guess that. I know you're into fat girls. I see the way you were staring at those girls. The way you look at their bodies, their tummies. They look soft, huh? I bet you wish you could squish them, huh? Hey, lady, stop projecting, okay? <laughs> Having said that, though, are you a fellow person of culture? We can build a great friendship off this. No, I bet you want me to grow even larger. <laughs> uh, I have no idea what you're on, lady, but I gotta go. Oh, come on. I know what you're into, man. I can see it in your eyes. You want to see that cute blonde turn into a massive ball of fat, huh? <laughs> but it's a shame that she's trying to lose all that weight, huh? Jeez, her fitness trainer is going to make her lose it all. But I know you don't want her to. Was she eavesdropping on us? What's wrong with her? I gotta go, I can't hear this crap anymore. I mean, she isn't wrong, but it's wrong to do that to them. I mean, she wants to be healthy. They all do. But they can't do that without their consent. But you're thinking to yourself that you can't do that. That you want them to better themselves. And that you don't want to make them gain weight non-consensually, hmm? Well, what if I could help you? Help you get them as plump as you want? Would you like to hear more? Hmm? Here's my number. Call me later and I'll tell you in more, more detail, but I think they're looking for you. Look, an ally in the in the fat game? I appreciate that, lady, but like, seriously, don't go up to random people assuming you know their special interests, okay? <laughs> oh, she left a phone number on the napkin. Bro, frickle, forget, like, bro, all those other ladies, they can, they can do, live their best lives. Get thin, anyway. I'm, I'm taking, I wanna, wh wh why can't we date this girl? And she's gone like that. Hey, Chad Tumseeker, what's taking you so long? And who was that girl you were talking to? Lie to her. Defu Seriously, I just say, I don't freaking know. She was weird. Uh, defu I'm not, look, I'm not gonna lie. I like, bro, I have plenty of deniability. Like, I can just say, like, she was some wacky lady wanting to, you know, all the get fat. I don't know. Diffuse question. I'm not sure. She just came out of nowhere and started talking to me like she knew me. Really weird. Oh, she was flirting with you. 
Well, you could put it like that. Uh, I wish it was just flirting. I really do. <laughs> what is this look? Huh, all right. Well, we're going to discuss our workout plan. You should come and join us. It's good for you to work out. You don't say, lady. I'll think about it sometime, but I need to get home. It's getting late. I'm pretty tired, but I did def like to hang out again sometime this week again. I mean, I'm taking a break before I start looking for a new job, so I should be free for a while, so hit me up. Oh, here's my new number. So call me, maybe? <laughs> I lost my old phone like the first month of the uni and had to get a whole new number, haha. <laughs> yeah, sure, that would be great. Just let me know when you're free and we can hang. I'll see you later. Well, well, I think that is, uh, that is all we'll do for today. Boy. Oh man, I love the art of this game so much. The art style is beautiful. Just look, just this room. This room. I, I, I want this room as like my desktop background. It's so good. I, dude, I would, I would, I would, you, this is the perfect room. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh. I love it. Also, the characters in this game are so adorable. Amazing, amazing work on that. For real. Check out at, at Epic Woomy. And if you want to play this game for yourself, head on over to smug.jpg.itch.io uh, to download this game and play it for yourself. There'll be a link in the description. Definitely interesting to, interested to see where the story goes. I mean, I think we can kind of guess where we're heading, but um, well, thanks for watching, everyone. We'll be back with another video tomorrow. You have a good one. Bye-bye.